Hello, welcome to another English lesson. My name is Michael with ACE English School Japan, located in Takasaki Guma. Okay, so before we get started today, as always, uh, if you like our videos, please subscribe, hit like, leave a message, uh, share this with anybody you think might use it. Also, to see what I'm saying, you might want to hit CC, closed caption. It will uh, show everything that I'm saying. Um, also, uh, look for the uh, translations down in the description. Okay, let's start. So today's lesson is going to be the difference between clean, clean up, and clean out. Okay? So clean is just to clean like a, like a room, like a messy room. So I have to clean my room. Clean up, clean up is after you've done something and made a mess, like clean up your toys or clean up after cooking. Clean out, clean out is when you sort, you sort things and you decide what to keep and what not to keep. Okay, so you clean out your closets. Okay, so let's uh, do some examples of these real quick. Okay, so I have to clean my room. I have to clean my room. Room equals bedroom. My room equals bedroom. Okay, so in Japan, sometimes they use room for apartment, but no, each apartment is an apartment than the apartment building. So I think it's because of hotels. In a hotel, it's room. But in an apartment, it's an apartment. So my room equals bedroom, bedroom only. Okay. Uh, I have to clean my room. Okay. You try. Good. Let me move this over a little bit. I have to clean my apartment. You try. Good. I have to clean my car. You try. Okay, so this one, clean my car is inside the car. Inside the car. Okay, it's messy or dirty. You have to clean your car inside the car. For the outside with the water, I have to wash my car. I have to wash my car. Okay, so first let's try, I have to clean my car. Good. The next one, I have to wash my car. Good, very good. Okay. Okay. I don't like cleaning up. After other people. Okay? I don't like cleaning up after other people. So other people, they take out things, they make a mess, you have to clean up. I don't like to clean up after cooking I don't like I don't like to clean up after cooking okay you can also say I don't like cleaning up after cooking both okay okay I don't like to clean up after cooking okay 
So cooking is fun. Cleaning is not so fun. Washing the dishes and putting things away. Okay? Okay, so let's practice these two. I don't like cleaning up after other people. You can also say I don't like to clean up after other people. Both okay because like. Okay. I don't like cleaning up after other people. You try. Good. I don't like to clean up after cooking. Good. Okay. Then I teach small children. So sometimes we say, and I have small children. So let's clean up and put away your toys. Let's clean up only is okay, but let's clean up and put away your toys is good also, okay? So let's practice, let's clean up. Good. Let's clean up and put away your toys. Good, very good, okay. out my closet. I have to clean out the clothes. Okay. I have to clean out my closet. I have to clean out my closet. Okay. That means to decide what to keep and what to throw away. What to keep, what to throw away, clean out. Okay. I have to clean out the garage. So same thing. Some things you keep, some things you sell, some things you throw away. Okay. I have to clean out the garage. I have to clean out your desk. Clean out your desk. If your boss tells you to clean out your desk, that means you're fired. You're fired. Clean out your desk means you're fired. Okay? Okay, let's practice this. I have to clean out my closet. Good. I have to clean out the garage. Good. Clean out your desk. Good. Very good. Okay? Garage is where you keep your car. Okay, it's the side house where you keep your car. A lot of people keep many things in there. Okay, so that's it for today. I hope you enjoyed the lesson. Uh, and like I said, if so, please hit like and share it with anybody who might be uh, interested. Okay, thank you. See you next time. Bye.